it's Natalie. Welcome to or welcome back to my YouTube channel. So in today's video, this video has been long awaited and I'm so, I'm so excited for you guys to finally see our nursery tour. This has been one of the one videos I've been dying to do and show you guys. If you are new to my channel, hi, my name is Natalie. I am having a baby girl. By the time you guys have seen this video, she might be here. She might still be in my tummy. I'm so excited to show you guys the nursery of my dream, literally. Every single thing in this room is definitely my vibe and Sam's vibe and just like a really happy and calm place to be. But I'm going to stop rambling and show you guys the room, but make sure you follow me on all my social media in the down box below. Let's get started. Okay, so walking into her room, you see this sign that says, Dear life, it's beautiful here. And this is like an overview of her whole room. This is the sliding door to our bathroom that connects to our room. So we're probably going to leave this open half the time just in case we have to like come and get her. Right near the door is this, I want to say it's, I don't know what the actual basket's called, but it's a hand-me-down. My mother-in-law, I think either made that or... It's been passed around the whole entire family, so I just put her blankets inside there and her milestone blanket. Then these prints, the one with the rainbow and then the heart, I believe I got them from I got them from Amazon. Her circle mirror is from Target. Then we got her dresser from IKEA. I really wanted something super simple and I like the black hardware. I was going to change it to brown, but I think I'm just gonna leave it. So her changing table is actually from Target. This is removable, so when she's not like in a diaper anymore, we can just remove it and it'll be a full dresser. Pads from Amazon. These little bins right here are from Amazon as well. I just wanna keep all of her diapers up here and Aquaphor and all of like her little bum cream. One of my best friends got her this. You can take it apart. She can play with it. I know I've showed this before in another video, but I labeled all of her stuff. These bins are from Amazon. So everything is labeled. And in this drawer, I have all of her newborn stuff. I labeled the drawers just in case anyone, like a family member comes, they know where everything is and they don't have to ask. Then over here, I have kind of her feeding station. This from the baby shower. It's a formula maker and it hooks up to your phone. We have like the little instructions right on the side. But I think this is going to be really, really handy for us. And then also right next to it is our little trash bin for her diapers. In this bin, it's all of her bottles. And then the bottom is all of her formula. This little shelf, I wanna say I got it from Target. I've had it since college. Then on this wall, I have pictures. So those two, I'm going to print out pictures of my mom and Arabella and then his mom and Arabella and then us holding her at the hospital. Then we have like a little plant and then my dog died. I wanted like a, her little paw in here. Then we have a candle and then these are all of her milestone like chips. And then this I saw on Amazon. Someone had it in their TikTok video and I had to get it, but... It comes apart so she can play with it when she's a little bit older. I have all of her wipes in this little bin. This is from Target. Her lamp is from Target. This is the baby book we had at our baby shower that everyone signed. She has a little piggy bank. This is one of the centerpieces we had at our baby shower. And then we got the vase, I want to say, at Hobby Lobby. We have this little humidifier. I don't know where I got that. And then we have the Alexa. We're using Alexa for her noise machine. And then it is sitting on this six cube table. I don't know what you call that, but are just books, more books. I don't know what I put in here. Oh, all of her bath stuff, toys for the beach, labeler alert, a labeler that's not gonna stay in there. And then this is empty. We do have blackout curtains, so those are from Amazon as well. And then the little beads that hold it. I really wanted more of like a boho themed style in her room, so these are from Amazon as well, and I feel like it really makes the room feel more warm. 
rather than like a metal type holder. I'm actually, I might change this. I don't really know. My mom got me this. Um, I kind of want something bigger right there, but I just don't know. Maybe like a newborn photo of her, but that is from Hobby Lobby as well. I got it on Facebook Marketplace and then I washed it. Like I cleaned and sanitized the whole entire thing and we got it for a really, really good price. This little pillow is from Target. Then over here, we have her name in the mobile and her crib, obviously. I'm gonna start on the floor though. Oh, so this is actually her play mat. I don't think I'm going to keep it there, but for right now, I don't have another place for it. But that's her play mat that's probably going upstairs. Her boho rainbow rug. I'm obsessed, I feel like this is the perfect size. This I got from H&M. Her crib is, I believe it's a Da Vinci crib. And it's really cool because it's actually going to grow with her. So when she's a toddler, you can like take it apart and make it a toddler bed. And then when she's older, it goes into, I think, a full-size bed or maybe a twin. So that's nice. I got the little barrier from Etsy so her feet don't get caught. And then this is just in there for right now. And then my mom got her this little lammy. Before her little mobile was really, really low because we had it attached to the crib. I didn't like that at all. So we actually hung it up. And it plays music as well. It'll spin. Her Arabella sign. I'm in love with this sign. One of our friends made her this sign. I feel like it's something she'll have for the rest of her life. And then we have the lollipop cam which is really nice because it syncs to our phone so we can always check on it. And then right here I have her little swing. This I might move upstairs just depending on how much I'm going to use it. And then right next to it is her laundry basket. I have a little more laundry to do, but yeah, that's basically it for that. That's actually from Target as well. Then right here is her closet. And I've done a video showing some of her clothes, but we're keeping her diapers in here. And then we have another big cube bin. And then in here, we just have some toys, travel items, tubby toys, um, travel carriers, medicines, and then nine to 12 month feeding items. And then this is kind of like storage right there. And then this is a lot of the traveling stuff, her bathtub and and then over there is like her pack and play. I'm so happy you guys are finally seeing her nursery. This has been such a process in the making. When we first found out we were having a girl, that's when we first started planning this room. And it's everything I could even imagine and more. I really, really wanted it to be family oriented. That's why we have the pictures of family that we're going to print. And really simple yet warm. Which is why there's like a lot of brown tones and neutral. So... I really, really wanted neutral colors and then light pink, Sam picked the wall color, which I'm so happy he did. I thought this was going to be like the worst color ever, but it turned out really, really good. Let me know what you guys think of the room. Anyways, guys, that is it for today's video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to see more of. And if you guys have any questions on where anything is from, I think I basically covered everything, but just in case I didn't, let me know in the comments down below. Bye, guys. See you in my next video. Bye.